better build that. Got printable is right. On to 76. Uh, we'll take Lyra. I don't know if we got a Lyra yet. Lyra's my favourite. Yeah, I had an excellent... I think she was a con construction dupe called Lyra on one playthrough that I particularly remember. I don't know why. I don't know if it was a particularly memorable playthrough, but I remember it. We're, we're closing up on, on 100. Uh, the, the frame rate's feeling it. Frame rate is feeling it. Uh, uh, what's that? Scalding. Who's scalding? Leo. I mean, may maybe, maybe we should cancel this. I think this, this is probably not a good idea. Leo. Well, uh, try and get you to do one at a time and then, uh, get in, uh, scalded immediately after doing one block. We'll, we'll just leave it. We'll leave it. Uh, set it to above 200, right? Well, we're a bit above 200 here, so, um, there you go. We would have to be very careful. Oh, is that a save? That's a save. I just wondered why it paused. <laughs> we're like 20 second saves now. There we go. I should be able to get Ellie out, I think. Very much hoping Ellie will have a think and sort it out. Uh, cool. Now this one should be able to petroleum. Petroleum, let's take a little bit in there. <laughs> exactly, exactly. I mean, to be honest, I, I could leave you doing that. It's, uh, you know, not like there's, there's a lot more else to do on this stuff planetoid, but, you know, honestly, it's, uh, it doesn't seem like a particularly responsible way to be doing it. Yeah, we just got to sink, sink the heat. I mean, I'm kind of at the point, but what we'll do is suffocating. Oh, that's weird. Should be suffocating on space. Um, I think we'll recover you, Leo, and we'll bring you back, because, uh, really, this just needs time now. Um, I don't think dupes are actually doing anything over here. So, we'll, um, we'll bring you guys back and, uh, leave this planetoid to, to settle. So, the, the heat will come out of the magma into the gas, the gas will go to space, and, uh, um... It will set itself out. They can do, Leo. There's, there's so much here to, um, there's so much here that it's kind of like a bit of a problem. I, like, it's it's going to be emptying the ocean with a bucket trying to use rovers, whereas just fed it to space. I don't know what's up with Dragon Killer, but anyway, he's stuck suffocating. So. Uh, you know, that that's cool. Yeah, we'll get rid of that. So we've got another like infinite storage type thing there. Um, this is ready to go, I think. Should be ready to go. So, um, yeah. I mean, actually, uh, do we actually need to get this done before we can turn it on? I mean, there, there's some reason the slicks are already struggling with um with the gas gases in here. You know, we can turn it on and we'll, we'll, we might just flood this with carbon dioxide. That could be the risk. But I'm kind of like, I want to see this run because we're going to take a bit of time to set this up. I haven't even finished building it, so let's uh, close it in again. Um, but we can turn this on. So if I reconnect this to the main grid and start pulling 40 kilowatts, uh, we, can, uh, we can hopefully get some sour gas in here and have some fun. Right, second boiler time coming online. This is the plan. This is the plan. Unfortunately, uh, Dragon Killer is going to be stuck suffocating for uh, for a while though. Okay, build that. Don't have any steel. How are we doing on this liquid? Is still going. Is this this line is just empty? Okay. What we can do is uh, uh, pile this in here, and uh, we will. Yeah, we'll uh, we'll make a way to fill these two with water. Um. Cool. 
so we got uh yeah we got the second sour gas boiler now trying to come online and um, we're just gonna watch this uh this vacuum out in the meantime but there's not any debris in here that's making stuff i don't think so what's that oil okay a little bit of oil in there yeah it's gonna take a while it's gonna take a while we'll see this is hype though this is hype Young is on the uh, on the installation. Can we get the uh, second sour gas boiler on? Oh, we got petroleum. We have petroleum, which is good. Okay, okay. okay. The uh, the coolant temperature is pretty cool, which is nice. These tiles are still coming down, which is not too bad. We have a vacuum out here. We do not have a vacuum out here. Why do we not have a vacuum? Is this open? This is open. Hmm. Second, second. This is open. This needs to be vacuum. Oh no, how did oh what? How did we how did this happen? Was there a tile here that got destroyed or something? Oh, that's annoying. Got sour gas and oxygen all in here. This was a vacuum before. Hmm. Something broke. Something broke. This is sealed. This is sealed. Oh, it was through here, wasn't it? it was through here. But is this open as well? This is open as well. Yeah, close that anyway. Okay. We'll close that. But yeah, we did come in from the side. So unfortunately, we're going to end up with um, a bit of uh, a bit of having to vent this out. That's probably probably a good reason to turn the um, turn this off. Um, plus the fact they still haven't built this, even though that's been uh, requested for ages. Okay, we'll turn that off, turn it off, and then we'll we'll revacuum this out, shall we? That seems like a good idea. Okay, right, that's looking good. That's looking good. Uh, what? No, okay. Did I pull you guys off? No. Okay, should do. Let's do that. Leofar's looking healthy. We've robbed all the tungsten we can get. No, hold on. Uh, one second, one second. Let's not do that. Let's rob the tungsten first and then grab it. Right, over here. I can, uh, can do that. I can suppress these damn notifications. So build that up. Uh, we've got this in here. You have healing buff. No, no, you do not. Um, let me grab this tungsten. No, I don't. I can't remember. I think I might have used one vaccinator on this run so far. I can't. Honestly, I can't remember. That noise is a bit annoying. Sorry, I'll, I'll zoom out from that. No, I mean, I think Bert's been doctoring you, so uh, that's that helps. Right, but we'll just grab this, get this loaded, and then uh, once we're in, we should be good to go. But we have managed to nab uh, another three tons or so, you know, which is uh, nothing to sniff at. We'll take it. Yeah, nice. You know, that's, uh, that's better than nothing. Begin. Let's go. Say, so Bert's, Bert's got you. You and Bert, you're, the, you're my dream team uh, explorers. Come on, you want to go? Bert has got it. You are on your way back. You're coming back. There we go. Should appear into space. I hope. Oh, there we go. Right, you're on your way back. And the planet, the drilling's ongoing. So yeah, we'll 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 leave that planet to it basically. Um, oh she, I'm now going to um, I'm now going to vent all of this. There's quite a lot here though. Where did all this nat gas come from? Just from over here. It's like there's like a, it's a one kilo there. Mm. Anyway, we're paint, painting a pretty picture. Mm -hmm. This, uh, yeah, this, 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 this boiler's fine. 
This boiler's stable now, so honestly, I don't know what it is. Maybe it's just getting it to exactly the right um, temperature to get the equilibrium good, but I don't, I don't know. Um, but anyway, we'll re-vacuum this, which is paying it's going to take a while. And then, um, in the meantime, we're vacuuming down here too, so that'll kind of come inside, I think. There's a bit of waiting to do there. What else can we do on this planetoid? This is the question. Um, I keep taking dupes. My food is stable, which is good. Um, what I did realise I haven't done on here is... Uh, um, uh, what was I saying? I haven't... Um, Oh, I can't remember what I was going to say. I haven't done something on here that I meant to do. <laughs> but what that was is currently escaping me. Uh, we're doing we're doing cooling. Uh, I haven't done any kind of food collection for the lettuce. Uh, the dupes are harvesting it because they kind of need to to reduce the number that we need. Oh, in fact, we can go back to pit planting as well. So let's uh, let's add this uh, this task again to my uh, to do list. That's exactly what I need, is more things to remember to do. Um, pop that over there. And get rid of that. So, uh, yeah, we should be able to plant that, which is fine. Then, um, now what we can do is pop the vent here and a vent here. And then we'll fill these up with water. Hopefully, if we've got enough water. Um. Okay, it's only 100 kilos. Okay, not ideal. We'll leave it. Um. So yeah, we'll get those filled up and then we can start trying to do cooling over here. Get the food storage set up. We might have to put in the um, conveyor loaders. That's what I'm saying. So we can at least grab the food in storage. It needs to be picked up by auto sweepers. Otherwise the dupes get stuck in an infinite cycle. Um, the way I've set it up. Either we have to set it up differently or stick in a load of auto sweepers. But we can do that. Um, cooling for oxygen. Yeah, it, it'll be base cooling and it'll be food cooling. Um, FYD. So it's a it's a double sided heat exchanger. Uh, like I use on my main on my main planetoid. So the um, the, the central cooling cools the central block and then you can um, you can cool off both sides so I use petroleum for that side and uh, water on the other we're just going to build that up we need to fill that with water to get a heat buffer I think Liam's got a slime lung there hopefully we should be replacing the polluted oxygen with oxygen as it uh, disappears we can probably get rid of the uh, sublimation stations. I'm kind of thinking how. Yeah, we can definitely get rid of these. Let's get rid of them. And that will also deal with the uh, slime lung. Um, but yeah, no, this is pretty much a copy and paste from the. Uh, well, from my standard design, which is also on the main, main planetoid. Uh, cool. Yeah, alright. So this is calling from the right for some reason. I assume it's because of this, uh, this obsidian up here is actually relatively cool. By relatively cool, I mean a thousand degrees, but you know, chilly. And um, that's, uh, yeah, kind of slowly solidifying this way. So, and this is only barely above 1400, so this this is good. This is good. I think this is set up somehow correctly that if we give it enough time, it will all turn to rock and vacuum itself. So I think it's doing everything we want. Um, you could say it's a bit chaotic. I think that's a fair criticism, yeah. Um, but it's, you know, if it's stupid and it works, then it's not stupid, you know? That's, a, that's what we're going for. Um, right. But yeah, this uh, this will, I think, will solidify. And then we should be able to finally get to both the tunnels of volcanoes. Uh, we can capture them properly and uh, get this one fixed and uh, captured. But if that's all vacuumed, we'll be in a much better, uh, better position to do that. Uh, right. This area, yeah. So I think we're just waiting on vacuum. Was there anything else I wanted to do? Right. I got distracted from doing water probably about uh, two hours ago. <laughs> two episodes ago in the VOD, I already got horribly distracted from doing this. Um, uh, right. What on earth is this? 
Right. So what I kind of want to do really is um is bring this this line over, don't I? I actually want to bring the the main power spine this way uh, and get rid of this mess. I'm kind of tempted just to deconstruct and just go with it. What else is this? What does this gas pump do? That's a right. This is a relic. This gas pump is from my uh, yeah, from my Draco ranches I was filling up. So let's have that. That's a load of stuff we don't need. Um, what we'll do is yeah. Are we going to stop our water? We will stop our water temporarily if we do it. But we've got we've got a lot on hand. So okay, it's time for a complete tear up. Where's this going? This is going here. This is defunct. Okay, get rid of that. Get rid of all of this. Uh, what is this pumping in? Nothing. Okay, I'll tell you what. Let's get rid of this, rid of this. We're having a complete rip out down here. This will uh, sort us out. Then I think what we'll do is come over the... No. Over the top here. And then uh, down the line here. And we will just, uh, yeah, there we go. Check a gee. What's a gee, Leofar? <laughs> I don't know what that is. Uh, no, it's a typo. What did you mean? Uh, right. Now we're going down here. We put that there. That should be unable to get to there. Actually, this, we should probably just get this material out, shouldn't we? Age of the pump. Ah, I see. Uh, oh, it's gone. It's gone, Leofar, it's gone. But this, uh, this, this gas pipe that came with it, what's that? 980 cycles, so that was about the same time. <laughs> so that, that pump's been there for about a thousand cycles. And for most of it, it's done nothing. So there you go. Uh, Um, we'll we'll tighten this up, and then what I can probably also do is I just come this way. So we'll tie we'll tidy everything up, and we'll make it uh, way neater. Um, look at <laughs> look at this! That's a conga line. <laughs> now we're just running to do the task. Uh, they're all going for it. There they go. There's my little dupes. I'm gonna grab that as a picture. I don't know if I'll use that as a thumbnail. Maybe, maybe not. But there you are. They're all a go. I've been making thumbnails like that for this uh, series by using the um, sandbox to add in way more dupes. But I don't even need to. They're just they're swarming. <laughs> they're like like ants. This is how we get stuff built quickly. Oh, I tell you what, it's a bit hot here again. Oh, it's plenty of that a couple of weeks ago, I think. But having kind of a prolonged heat wave in the UK. So uh, not so comfortable. Uh, yeah, so that was this is this is a good thing to be doing. And um, what else was going on over here? I think we could just shut this in, right? That was something that we uh, said we were going to do ages ago, and it never did. Uh, right, rock, rock, rock. <laughs> Proof you have a fifth of the target. <laughs> oh god. Okay, we're going to cycle five thousand. There we go. We've extrapolated. That's where we'll end up. Um, right. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna pull this like that, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna pull this like that. Yeah. Oh no, this goes through the fish. That's why. That's why I didn't do that before. Yeah. Okay, but. Even if it does go through the fish, that's, we don't want to do that. Fine, but uh, let's have that bridge, and then okay, no, I don't want a bridge. <laughs> oh, I, I really, don't, I'm thinking my PC is not going to make it. I was confident at one point. I was confident that um, my PC could handle it. But we'll see. 
Let's see. I haven't actually tried like 400 dupes in sandbox or something, you know, just to, just to whack it up. Um, right. Uh, this line... This line's also defunct. Uh, this line is defunct. Get rid of that. Then... There's no reason why we can't... Why does this one not go into here? That's my question. That one should go into there. And then... What? Uh, we'll... We'll build that one into there. And then this one can come along here. Look at that. Uh, we'll tie this all up. I right, turning current save into sandbox. Yeah, I could, I could try. I could try. Right, in the meantime, let's do the stupid thing and take more dupes. Ooh, uh, yes. Liam. I think we've got a billion Liams already, but we're taking a Liam. Um, I should really have a look at um, skills, shouldn't I? Because I'm sure I'm neglecting giving them skills. I'm going to spend uh, I'll spend ages giving them a load of skills. Uh, right, so another Liam. Yeah, sure. Meemaw, have some stuff. I don't know, poison's good. There's some new dupes here, they just have... Just have one point. Uh, signed when I took them and then I never did anything else. Uh, like, I don't know. We'll, we'll give you a hat or two. So I'm going to spend a little time doing this. I don't want to spend ages. I get bored doing this, and I hope you... I, well, I want to say hope. Maybe you guys get bored too, so I don't know. I don't want to spend ages in the damn uh, skills menu. Uh, uh, I don't know. Maybe you need anything. You don't need anything. So, um, yeah, go and go with a strat of giving them hats when, uh, when they're, they're all... Well, anyway. <laughs> I, I normally don't mind, but there's so many dupes that trying to give them all damn hats and skills. Oh, I could, I could spend probably about half an hour just giving them skills. And that's not good stream content. So, you know, I'll, um, actually, I might do that. Um, I might do that off stream. We'll see. Uh, maybe b before I start up the next stream, we can um, we can have a play with them and make sure they uh, they all get skills. And then I can, sp uh, can save you guys the... Uh, Having to watch that tedium of uh, going through them all, give them skills. We'll see. We'll see. Okay, so yeah, this is this is going, and this is ever ever increasing over this way, which is nice. So that's just to leave it now over here. Okay, I do need to kind of keep an eye on this because uh, it will be in trouble otherwise. Oh no, actually, because it's low pressure. Uh, what I can do is what. It let's me and connect that with that and it should go it should go over here and fill that when we're done as long as we get a little bit of water in there we'll we'll close it up and we'll do the same over here and then actually we're kind of close to getting this online that's the main thing over there that we do have a lot of idle dupes but that's fine um, the petroleum boiler is still running, isn't it? I mean, you know, I haven't really been checking in on this at all, but it's, uh... I'm sure well, now I fixed it following the uh, tutorial bite I made and learned how to do it properly. <laughs> um, it's all fine now. Yeah, they have a lot of, uh, a lot of building work to do over here. Now, we can always set them to strip mining. I don't think these guys are bored on this planetoid. I mean, this is looking, uh, it's looking good. Still not looking filled out. I mean, the the top section, I'd say, where is is looking quite good. This bit is is pretty packed, not completely, but uh, you know, it's um it's busy, busy at least. Down here, there's pretty much nothing here. You know, there's like a little bit in the corner, the, the boiler. We've got the odd thing, the old base, which um is really just um making meal wood, meal lice, and slowly running me out of dirt. I'm still living off. I got a lot bigger meal. Uh, but yeah, then there's just a lot of empty space. Like this, this whole area of the map is just pretty much untouched. I think obviously I strip mined it, but you know, this, the odd thing, it's pretty much, you know, as it was. So, oh, that's a challenge. I'm trying to fill fill up this map as well. Um, cool. Uh, I 
But yeah, this is this is looking good. Looking good. Ah, okay, right. Now what I've done here is been an idiot. Because I don't actually want these to go straight into here. I want them to go into here. Hmm. So, so, so. Uh, what we're going to do is this. We're going to deconstruct loads of this. And cancel loads of this. Whoops. My bad. My bad on that one. Let's, uh, let's get rid of that. Because actually what we want to do is... Uh, there's a lot of rock just fell out of the sky. Uh, that always looked like a sandbox command, the amount of stuff that came out. No, we'll do it this way, we'll do it this way, and then you should be able to uh, connect into that. That's the right way to do it. There we go. Remembered what I was doing. Cool. Okay, so this is still going over there. I uh, don't like that. Don't like that. All right, okay, that's why it disconnected. There we go. Clever me, clever me. Now, what was this one powering? I oh, know that no, not that one. This one uh, over here. Is that running off that too? That's running off that too. So what I should do. I can't even remember what's meant to go down here. Um, uh, put in a transformer here. Keep it on pause to go on. Go for it, guys. Uh, I've got some steel back too, which is nice. Um, we'll we'll loop this over and um, run this down. And we should be able to hopefully just detach everything in one go and problem solved. Okay. Let's get rid of that. And this bridge. So we used to we're on tidying up time because it uh, does my head in when it's not tidy. Um, plus this area is very critical in terms of piping. Uh, runs over each other and stuff. Can't really afford to um, play fast and loose with this. Okay, now can do that one. Excellent. Uh, is there? Okay, there wasn't a pipe behind that. That's very interesting. So very bad for, for liquid flow, so let's uh, turn that back on. Before we back this whole pipe up. Real. Right. Okay, we're probably going for another 20 to 30 minutes here. Hopefully we'll uh, keep getting this done. Da -da -da -da. Is that going in? That's going in. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. Um, is that on high priority? Yeah, come on, guys. Okay. Okay, there's a bridge there. That. Cool. No, we're almost there, we're almost there. Is that built? No, someone's on it. Meep's on it. Um, I don't neglecting the other planetoids at this point. Right. Excellent. So that tidies that up. So that one comes in the top. Um, then we can get rid of this. Uh, no. Oh, no. Hold on. Yeah. No. Ah! Yeah, get rid of this, this, and this. And um, we can kind of make these run straight. So at least we've got some outputs. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Is this one built? This one's built already. Um, that's power. We got power over here. Yeah. Uh, close that in. And what was the temperature for this? 
This is uh, the 10 degrees. This is below 10 degrees, above 10 degrees. Pump and don't turn on that. Excellent. So we can have rid of that. Uh, we can connect that in to recover that liquid. Um, right, then we need to get the power going before we can swap these grids over. I think this is fine. Fine. So we we chop that, get rid of this, rid of this, rid of that, rid of that. Then uh, this become, becomes that, chop that. Get rid of this, uh, not that. Get rid of all this and connect that and disconnect that. Get rid of that, kill that, um, and connect that and disconnect that and that. That makes sense. And reconnect that. Why is this overloading? Actually, genuinely drawing too much current. That kind of, kind of makes sense. Uh, uh, and and that. Yep. Cool. Desalinators on. Nice. Thing to do is stop rebuilding the same system too much. Uh, and move towards making other systems. Always going for better efficiency with a small difference. Yeah, maybe. I mean, it's a difficult balance, isn't it? I mean, you kind of got to... There's, there's a lot of fun in just making stuff more efficient. So it depends on what you're going for. I mean, you can... Uh, you're more, more than welcome to do that, Leo. Oh, there's no, no reason with... Nothing wrong with them with doing that. Uh, okay. But, yeah, I... I'm just looking for stuff to do on this main planetoid because I'm just kind of what we've been mostly waiting for, which I'm not keeping an eye on at all, is is this pumping out and uh, um, and this vacuuming out. So it's going to be a little while before we can vacuum them. I mean, I could just turn them. I could turn this on and just you know say go for it. Um, because it's going to take a hell of a while otherwise. And then we'll see. We'll reconsider, but at least if the, we can minimise the volume in here that'd be better um so i'm just waiting for this stuff to come online um dragon killer's really not having a fun time i really hope he gets back soon um and we can at least get rid of that damn warning so annoyed with that warning um cool we've done that up uh, yeah okay so i'm just trying to tidy up those pipes uh for my own sanity firstly and uh Secondly, I think it's just a good thing to do for our understandability. And uh, also this is helping us get more, more water in uh, as well, you know. We, uh... Ah. So I have too many, I have too many pipes here. I can... Uh, right. We can uh, we can get rid of this. Let's get rid of this. Uh, not that. There you go. Yeah, I'm all about I'm all about efficiency as well. Just gotta keep it uh, keep it neat. So this should be flowing from both of these. Yeah, so both of these are good. We've now officially captured them. We can probably do grabbing this water, and there's a, there's a cool steam vent we could also grab if we wanted. Um, but yeah, our water in should be pretty uh, pretty high at this point. A lot of water in, which we're going to need. See, it's gone down a bit, quite a bit. Um, yeah, the, the volumes of, or well, the masses of water we're going to need to sustain this base is huge. Uh, you know, I, I've done the mass at an overall level, but honestly, in terms of keeping up with where we are and uh, are we still okay? I hope so. 
No, I really hope so, but you know, it's uh, it's tricky. I'm not exactly calculating minute by minute as to whether I've actually got enough water or not, so um, you know, we could be setting ourselves up for uh, problems. But, you know, I, I don't know what else we can do about it, unless I keep going and uh, calculating everything to the nth degree. It's, um, it's tricky. It really is tricky. Um, right, see, so we've got a little bit of carbon dioxide stuck in here. Hopefully, will that get deleted or will that just over pressure? We'll play the uh, we'll play the game where we find out. Um, we might have to stick a block in there just to dis destroy the carbon dioxide. Um, but this is looking good. Uh, Mr. Mr. Uwek. Uh, I don't know how you're saying that, but uh, thank you for the follow. Two of you were lurking away there. But, uh, so that's not a problem. Thank you for, uh, for popping in and for uh, leaving us a follow. Oh, now almost 250 followers. We are okay. Ah, so the water did flow. We're all good. Um, now what we can do is uh, cut this off. Definitely cut this off and uh, get this uh, water in. Hopefully before uh, they deconstruct it. I don't want water in this cooling loop. I want water. Um, I do want water in some of the cooling loops, but. Uh, not in all of them. Right. Du -du 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 -du. Is this one done? Ah, this one's done, yeah? Excellent. Right. Cool. This one's also done. So, um, what we can do is just root this. Root this in here. Uh, we'll get rid of the bridge. We'll get rid of all of this. Um, rid of that. Honestly, I don't know what on earth is going on with this stuff. There we go. So we do have some work for them to do over there. Okay, we're just keeping an eye on the tongue. So unfortunately, we weren't able to get the tongue. So I set that as my uh, as my stream title for. Uh, the stream for the last couple of episodes. Oh, hold on a minute. Okay. It's having a long save. Um, but yeah, we, we haven't managed to do that, but we have made a lot of progress in getting there. So I'm I'm actually reasonably happy with how this has gone, although uh, we didn't do it in the best way. The, the result is good. The result's good. And the, uh, yeah, the magma is all solidifying. So will slowly slowly work its way over here I think as the heat just dissipates into the entire asteroid entire planet at least the guys just can inject metal already you think um oh yeah yeah we're down to we're over pressured in here actually and this is locked which is not good so actually we probably need to open this one up but um yeah this one can but it's dormant uh, anyway it's um yeah uh, it's not e going to be easy to get the tungsten out of it anyway, even if they could um, produce. So the fact that they're not isn't going to be a major issue. Plus, it'd just be adding more heat down here, which we, it's kind of the opposite of what we're trying to achieve. Um, it is solidifying, which is good. Yeah, this stuff's actually fairly cool in uh, relative terms. So effectively that's going to be the goal, is to try and get this to all solidify and in the meantime all the gas is venting to space. So, uh, you know, we, we should end up with a solid hot core and a vacuum in the ideal scenario and then I can just come and we can just dig it. Then, you know, uh, once we've got vacuum we can just put whatever liquid we want anywhere and I can ship them from the first planetoid. Uh, easy peasy. So, you know, uh, fingers crossed that's how it goes. That's the plan. We'll see if it works. Um, okay, we're coming into the milligrams on there, and this is probably still well in the grams, which is rather annoying. 150. And from down here, 300. I think we were about one kilo here, weren't we? Now we're down to 150. So this is definitely losing gas, obviously. Um, I might just open, just open some of this up to so get rid of even more. Um, more here. That puff just got to die, I'm afraid. 
Uh, keep the critical down. Ah, pit planting too, right? This was something that I um, I said I could start, and I entirely forgot about. Uh, so we can do that. Why not? And let's grab the old pips. Uh, we can wrangle these ones out of places that they don't need to be. You see someone's been sticker bombing there. Um, any more? Uh, that can die. And that can die. Try and get rid of the critters. Yeah, we've already got two pips in here, which is good. So we can just keep going with that. And we've got way more seeds too. They're, they're definitely making seeds now, which is good. Pop tear drums. So we... We've got pop tear drums. There are rather large amounts of... Uh, Oxygen in here. I don't know how that's happened. It's always uh, deconstruct bug the top of the roof off again, you know, and uh, go from there. Mm -hmm. Suffocating. Diamondine. Yeah, for some reason, some reason these guys are now giving me suffocating alerts. Even though I've been doing the same thing the entire game and uh, they were fine before. Now they're all suddenly suffocating. So, what's going on with that one? Honestly, I have no idea. Uh, a mystery to me, I'm afraid. I think it's, it must just be to do with the game lagging and uh, not liking it. Uh, right, now is this... just wonder if this is actually slowing it down or not. I don't think so. Because these can output 49.50 each, right? 46.50 even, so... I think this is not being so done. Why is this only... Is there a, there a cross link? Uh, I think, yeah, these were still connected. There we go, that's more like it. Good. Fix that one. Yeah. This should be what I like. Yeah. Okay. We're just pouring water in here. We've now got four outlets all going. Uh, and a lot of water. Which is great. Okay, okay, what's going on? Yeah, stuff lacks resources. Yeah, okay. Can I can I get rid of them? Get rid of these? We needing niobium. Are we down on niobium? Okay. Probably a good idea to have that. But uh put five of each in. Stick some niobium back. Keep the cycle going. Um Right, what's going on over here? Now I've got to keep checking pit planting again, yay. Um, <laughs> Alright Leo, no, no worries, I'll, I, I won't be going for much longer, so I think you've caught pretty much all of the stream. So, uh, uh, as always, uh, super appreciate you, um, you hanging out with me, um, hopefully you've enjoyed. Uh, and uh, yeah, I'll, uh, I'll catch you about, we're always on the Discord, which is good. We'll see you there. Uh, right. Um, cool. And yeah, I should say for anyone that's watching on YouTube uh, and haven't joined the Discord, the Discord is linked in the description. So, um, you know, more than happy for you guys to join as well. Would love uh, more people to talk to the better. So, come say hello in there. Uh, cool. So, we'll send some steel across. Now, uh, what needs to happen here is this, this, what is this? That comes in there, and then this. I think this is how this works. Hopefully that works. Okay, this is horribly off uh, off position. I think I've gone off by one really. I could move the steam turbine over. That's probably the answer, isn't it? Uh, answer is move steam turbine. I I thought I sold them to put polluted water in here. Do we have to enable auto bottle? Cool, cool, cool. Let's sort that out. Um, yeah. Once we get this loop tidied up, we can. Uh, uh, we can fill it. That looks a bit better, doesn't it? Better to me. 
I want to say about 30. Oh, we've actually got stuff for these guys to do, which is nice. Keep an eye on this, I'm just going to propagate. I keep clicking on it, probably out of habit more than anything else, but... Uh, there you go, right, 78, pupe 78. Uh, I don't like those, I don't like any of them, but Harold, you are, you don't have any major do downsides. This is how we're picking dupes now, if they don't have a major downside, we'll have them. Uh, right, Harold, get inside, and we'll give you a skill to start, and you probably won't get another one for ages, but there you go, you got one. Um, I think we're okay on docks, schedule-wise. Uh, we, we're okay just about because we've got one in space, but we should fix that. So we're down into plus 10 already. This is getting crazy. Uh, 10. Come on. 10. 10. Uh, the pain. pain. Right. 78 dupes and counting. We are, we are climbing. The food is still stable which is nice um i haven't really been keep, keeping a close eye on that so uh, fortunately it is stable otherwise i was gonna have problems but th that's the one way i can see this going wrong is that we have a mass dupe uh, starving entirely by accident uh why have we got no penny deliveries is there not oh the pitcher pump isn't even in polluted water anymore i see interesting in here we can put one here and grab it from there uh, and then hopefully, yeah, hopefully our miners can come back and then stop suffocating, because that, hmm, that notification is, has been annoying me for a long time. Uh, yeah, okay, we have, we have used a lot of that. Uh, how much uh, steel are we sending through? I don't know. Don't want to send all of it through, but we need to send through enough. Uh, is this stop? This has stopped getting water now, so that's not good. Um, we should probably fill that up. That's a good idea. Da -da -da. Cool. And then once we get enough steel for this, we can fill this loop. And we'll just fill this. We good? Is that it? No, it needs another delivery. Okay. I'm a little sure exactly how long to go for because of the uh, we had a little bit of time at the start and then some internet outages which uh, um, will take away from the time that I wanted to stream. So I'll probably shoot for another, I think another 10 minutes or so and we'll call that there. So we might make it through maybe two cycles in that time. Maybe we'll get to the start of um, 89 or 90. 10, 10. We will see, we'll see. But we've got a little bit more to go. Um, and then we'll wrap it up there. But still, yeah, lots to do. Lots to do. We are finally taking dupes, which is good. Um, looking forward to getting to 100. 100 is going to be a nice milestone to reach. So, uh, it's, not, it's not really going to do much for us, you know, in, immediately. It's not like it's going to change the game, but... Uh, tough. Right, no, oh, no, no, no. Okay, can I just find some polluted water oh sorry um just please find some just a tiny bit to go in here can you can you please not be a pain for me um no okay, what we'll do is we'll fill this up and then we'll put the well in fact we can just do that now we'll put a transformer here Um, yeah, and we'll route this this way, and then we can just run that inside. Uh, okay, okay. Something's pinging. I don't know what it is. I didn't catch it. But we'll see. Okay. Back. You're driving today. Actually, back. Oh, you're back sitting. Oh, well, that that was short-lived. Yeah. <laughs> no worries. I, I don't know if you caught what I'm saying, but I'm I'm going to wrap up soon anyway. So uh, we're uh, we're almost there. Almost there. Okay. So we're down to 300 milligrams in here. 
There's 600 on the oxygen, but that's fine. Um, so that'll be good. And then, um, yeah, we're still vacuuming out everywhere else. So we'll just set this going. I'm going to need some petroleum over here now, I think. I did shoot some through the, uh, the, the supply teleporter at one point, but I've no idea where that's gone. Uh, I really hope this is okay. I haven't... This, I mean, technically this is leaking heat, but... Uh, it's fine. Um, yeah, I can't... Where's my supply teleporter gone? That's the that's the output. It's this one. It's this one. We'll have to um, we'll have to nab some petroleum out of here, and we'll have to. Oh, that's going to be fun, isn't it? We'll have to route some petroleum through to um, through to the input. Is that that one? Okay. Hmm. We can bottle empty it, but there's. Oh, look, this is just okay. It's tiny bit liquid. Yeah, we can bottle empty it and then grab it. That seems like a sensible way to do that. Awesome. We've got some polluted water in here. Sort of asking. Ages. And if we can stick some normal water, it will all be good. Yeah, we'll we'll bottle empty some petroleum and grab that across. And then um, once they build this, which they've almost done, we can uh, we can fill well we can fill this loop. Ah. We can fill this loop, if I can uh, grab it. Uh, this way. Right, they're already going for it, which is fine. Uh, it doesn't need to be completely full, does it? So that seems that seems fine. Uh, right, got a bit of water in there. I need a little bit more water. Cool. Now, interestingly, we've got two gas pockets here, so if we just uh, dig both of them. Uh, now over here, yeah, we will need to make a base cooling loop, but I'm going to be doing that next time. So this one, this loop is actually on. Yeah, yeah so just, just open the space above it and then the gas will push up and then you end up with the, uh, uh, the perfect, perfect liquid. Uh, for the steam room, that's great. That's a good tip. Including that in the, in the story bike. Cooling, of course. Um, ah, right, this one isn't grounded. It should be grounded. I'm guessing people keep getting stick, stuck in there. Stick in there, stuck in there. That's the right word. Um, okay, uh, what was going on down here? <laughs> Are we all good with the water now? I think we're all good with the water, yeah? I think this is the case. Get rid of those. Uh, you're kind of tempted to actually just shoot this in here. I mean, I don't see why we can't just do both. Uh, that's all good. Why is this... This one kind of doesn't need to be here. Get rid of that. So, oh, lots of water, although the number is hmm, borderline going down, I'd say. So, we need to be a little bit careful. Um, does infinitely storing liquid cause duplication? Not that I'm aware of, Leofar. Um, not that I'm aware of. I haven't heard about that, so. Uh, I would say no. I, I, yeah, don't recognise it. Uh, 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 okay, so this this should be built now, so we can finish this off. Why are we building heavy lock conductive? All right, that was copied across from the other planetoid. That's fine. And then what we should do as well is make a second spawn, and we really need to capture these. Um, these water geysers, don't we? So there's one, there's one there, there's one there, there's one there. We haven't really captured them properly at all. Um, right, okay, but we'll make it to the end of the cycle and then I'll wrap up. So, um, 
I'll call that the end of the end of the stream shortly. And bear with me, we'll do the normal uh, normal conclusion. This plant I think I'm going to leave alone for now because effectively, we, next time next time we'll be building uh, the cooling loop for the base, and uh, we've got to fill the. Uh, um, also I've just realized I've made this water even though actually this needs to be super coolant because I need to get this cold enough to get the petroleum down so I've filled that with the wrong thing um, anyway yeah water's not going to cut it but silly me on that one um, and this plantoid is still creeping along the, the igneous rock is continuing to creep and hopefully the yeah the gas or uh, mass is just ever decreasing from down here down to mm, 60 kilos this was about 200 I think when we started so definitely going down if you know right I uh, think people make duplication machines using the same mechanisms as an initial waterfall Let's see oh, thanks for the follow <laughs> King stupid so uh, have you lurking away there? Thanks for the follow. You're uh, <laughs> almost up to 250, so that's going to be uh, another small milestone on the way. Um, yeah, I I mean, if it does duplicate, I mean, at this point, I'd take it because it would help secure my water supply, but it would be a little bit cheaty, but um, I'm not aware of it, so you know, I don't know. I'll have to do some, uh, some looking into that. I don't think it is. I don't know. I know the water le levels are jumping around all over the place, so it's kind of... It's kind of hard to know actually how much you've got, unless you um, you pause it and do a count. It doesn't distribute well and it, it fluctuates a lot. So, ah, right. Well, we've gone well over the time. So, um, I'm going to start wrapping up. So, what uh, have we managed to do this stream? So, the um, the second sour gas boiler is ready to go. Um, I managed to get some petroleum. Uh, the reason I haven't turned it on is because I was trying to vacuum this out. But what we might do is just turn it on anyway uh, and go with it and just vent the this stuff out the top when the steam comes but anyway this one is ready to go so that's great and we built all of this so the second uh, natural gas um generator area is built and pretty much ready to be turned on and um, probably quicker to do that uh what else we want we're taking on more dupes so i think we've got about another 10 or so we seem to be getting about 10 every three hours so it's gonna take a while for us to uh to get to 400 if that's the target um but that is the target, so we'll, we'll try and get there. Um, we can do some space mining, not super important. And obviously we've been on the marshy planetoid, which I'll get to in a second. Um, up here, not too much, not too much. Um, we've expanded the uh, expanded the industrial brick with the slickster arches in the carbon dioxide one. So just vacuuming that out so we don't get any odd gases. That's almost gone. We're down to 100 milligrams, kind of in the worst areas. So... Probably a couple more cycles and this will be vacuumed and then we just open it from the top and uh, carry on as if everything's normal. So that will give us more room and the uh, carbon dioxide lines are feeding into the brick, which is great. Um, what else have we done down here? We've been doing a lot of tidying on pipes, so uh, this is still looking a little bit messy. I can see uh, some uh, things that look like that. There you go. That looks a bit neater again. Um, get rid of that. So this is looking a lot tidier and the power is also looking uh, way neater down here. This is a bit of uh, spaghetti, so uh, that's good, help keeping us in order. We've also sorted out the, uh, actually being able to harvest these um, these saltwater geysers, which is great because that's just a lot of water that we weren't collecting. We should have been, we may well go for this steam, cool steam next time. There's another cool steam here blocked up, so we could try and grab those, um, but that's going to need a cooling, uh, cooling element to it, so... Uh, we'll see. Um, we'll see, yeah. I have to have a think about that, because if I'm having to run cooling from somewhere far away, it's going to be a pain. Otherwise, we'll have to run a uh, run a power wire down. We've got loads of power coming off here, so we could try and do something. But then that would mean ripping up the left half of the map, which we haven't done yet. So, uh, a lot of work on this planetoid. On the uh, second one, we have started pit planting again. Although I keep going to keep forgetting about it, but we're doing it. Uh, so we've got enough seeds to go across that next row. We'll keep going with that. Um, we've got the SPOM online. Rodriguez is going. 
the uh, cooling area is set up it just needs filling so I need to correct this by putting super coolant in there petroleum in there and then we can get this loop built and set up with water for the base area uh, so a lot to do with that uh, but got some good progress and then finally on the, this third planetoid so the marshy outer one um, I kind of made a complete absolute mess uh, everything overheated as we try to deal with this magma but it is slowly solidifying which is the plan so my current plan is to just uh, solidify out and uh, let the gas vent to space and then um, fingers crossed on there we should be okay in the meantime uh, this uh, volcano is not doing anything uh, and this one is also dormant don't know how long for so uh, yeah this this isn't going to work so well until we um, get back here so this could be offline for a while but once it does I hopefully think we'll have three active and captured tungsten volcanoes which would be great because that will help us get more thermium uh, to build more mesh tiles out of probably and the most overkill uh, mesh tile material you can think of will be building loads out of thermium because uh, it's quite an easy way to make lots of it so um, that's all we've done there so I think we'll wrap up this uh, episode and uh, thanks for joining me and I'll see you in the next one